The Kochi International Container Transshipment Terminal ICTT, locally known as the Valarpatam Terminal, is the first transshipment terminal in India and the first container terminal to operate in Aces. It is part of the Cochin port in Kochi, Kerala, India. Being constructed in three stages, the first phase of the terminal was commissioned on of February 2011. This can handle cargo up to 1 million TEUs 20 -foot equivalent units per annum. On completion of the third phase, the terminal will be able to handle 5.5 million 20-foot equivalent units TEUs of cargo per annum. The terminal is operated by the Dubai Ports World DPW, which will operate it for 30 years after which the control will come back to the Cochin Port Trust. History On 16 February 2005, Dubai Ports World announced that it has signed an agreement with the Cochin Port Trust to construct, develop and operate an International Container Transshipment Terminal and India Gateway Terminal, at Valarpadam. The project was, formally, launched with the laying of the foundation stone by Manmohan Singh, the Prime Minister of India. The ceremony was attended by Dr. Jacob Thomas, Chairman, Cochin Port Trust and Sultan Ahmed bin Sulayam, Executive Chairman, DP World. The proceedings were overseen by the Governor of Kerala, Mr. R. L. Bhatia, the Minister of Shipping, Government of India, T.R. Balu, and the Chief Minister of Kerala, Mr. Uman Chandi. Approval for the agreement was given by the Cabinet Committee of Economic Affairs of the Government of India, Ministry of Finance and meanwhile, the DP World will manage and subsequently transfer its operations at the Rajiv Gandhi Container Terminal in Cochin Port to the new terminal upon its completion. The DP World has been granted a 38-year concession for the exclusive operation and management of the site. Overview. Valarpatam Terminal is the first in the country to operate in a special economic zone. In the first phase there will be 600 metres key length and a draft of more than 15 metres, when the terminal may handle 1 million TEU container annually by the end of 2012. In the second phase the capacity will be enhanced to 3 million TEUs by the end of 2014. In the third phase the terminal may handle even up to 5.5 million TEUs the total cost of the project is estimated at 3200 crore rupees DP World has estimated that the total initial investment required will be approximately $20 million which includes the immediate provision of four RTGs and two mobile harbour cranes to the terminal to improve yard handling, truck turnaround time and quayside operations. Strategically, located on the main east-west global shipping lines and offering draft of about 16 metres, Cochin is destined to develop as the premier gateway to southern India, as also offering an alternative to Sri Lanka and Singapore for containers being transshipped for the Indian market. <laughs> <laughs> Location The terminal is located in the Valarpatam Island in Kochi. Topic. Opening On the 11th of February 2011 the terminal was inaugurated by Manmohan Singh, the Prime Minister of India. The ceremony was attended by A.K. Antony, G.K. Vasan, K.C. Venu Gopal, R.S. Gavai, V.S. Achuthanandan, K.V. Thomas, Vyalar Ravi, C.P. Joshi, Mullapali Ramachandran, and N. Ramachandran. Timeline The 1st of February 2005, commenced construction for Phase 1 The 16th of February 2005, concession agreement signed The 9th of February 2011, first train arrived at ICTT The 11th of February 2011, Dr. Manmohan Singh Prime Minister of India dedicated ICTT to the nation 12 February 2011, first containers arrived at ICTT. 18 February 2011, first vessel arrived at ICTT, OEL Dubai. 21 July 2011, MV. Maersk Sembawang, largest vessel handled at ICTT, arrived. 
Topic See also Vembanad Bridge National Highway 47C India Inland Port Kochi LNG Terminal